welcome to Bambina Games, this is Eki. Today, I'm going to play Serena. Laura has played this, and her video will be Sometimes, up at some point. Effort, I can remember her um, but yes. Sweetness of her so, breath. let's go. Serena. Oh, hello. Alright then. Let's see we can find fuzzy photograph that's serena why can't i see you more clearly because fuzzy why can't i even remember fuzzy fuzzy serena enjoyed spice in her life Got a little bit of spice i preferred it more bland you always put too much salt in dear Think about your pressure. Think about your pressure. The furniture came with the cabin. Don't even know what that was. Off the beat <laughs> okay. Path, sometimes she would brush her leg against mine under the table. <laughs> the oh dear. Okay. Curious, oh, oh, thrill. oh, we get up. Oh, there we go. Ah, let's try. So, what can we do over here? Ooh, cobwebs. Lovely. So, you. There's a th is there a th uh, there's a thing. Oh, bottle of wine. Lovely bottle of wine. Love a good bottle of wine. <laughs> Moving on. Sharing meals with a good red wine was one of the great Got pleasures of our one? relationship. Yeah. I should probably eat. <laughs> I can't remember the last time I you ate. Can't remember the last time you, you ate. I feel hungry. Dude. Gotta get a good eating habits. I have more pressing things on my mind right now than culinary exploits. Culinary? Cu culinary. Cu You're confusing my brain. The stove looks like something from World War One. Gotta agree with that one. <laughs> okay. Considering how basic and ancient the kitchen is, it's a wonder what we managed to do with it from time to time. Well, she was. Dude. Do the cooking sometimes. Okay, so ooh, lovely stack of 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 kind of dark looking books. So you want to be a purple tentacle? Okay, that's. Um, interesting. Um, yeah. <laughs> Moving on. Um, uh, so that was that one. What's on here then? <laughs> I still can't understand. Even the features Zombie of the space dinosaurs from the deep ate my family. <laughs> Actually, sounds kind of interesting. Um, pugs, not drugs. <laughs> oh my god, I wonder if Laura saw that. Pugs, not drugs. Okay. Oh dear. <laughs> oh dear, oh dear. Um, must be something that reminds me of her. Can I click on that one? So much wisdom and happiness in this book. Wisdom and happiness. Okay. My life um, would have been much poorer without Oh, more books. Okay, what's on this one then? <laughs> the crazy. Crazy? Uh, okay. And that's why I'm single. A memoir. That is going to be the story of my life. Okay. The smell of old books is intoxicating. Right, okay. What happens to wood pulp as it ages gives it that distinctive <laughs> vanilla smell. <laughs> what the... uh, ooh, what, where's, where's that? Oh, it's printed the chat. So many afternoons spent <laughs> in this arm. What are you singing it for? So many afternoons. Come sit with me. I want to talk. Oh, dear. And cuddle. Cuddles. What did we talk about? You Damn didn't. You just cuddled, my friend. 
cuddles happened. So that's a lovely creepy picture. And nothing you can do with it. Ooh, window. Let's have a look at the window. This window never got much attention. Ooh. Then again, the view isn't nearly as spectacular. I don't know. I can't see anything. I see a few beams right? on there. Where are we? This Ooh. one wobbles. Wobbly, wobbly. I always meant to do something about that. Oh, another picture. Somehow, never got around to With it. With a hairy child in the middle. Why are they? Are they in the bath? Why are they wearing clothes? That. <laughs> I'm confused. Okay. There's nothing we can do with that. Oh, oh, can we go outside? No, I don't want to leave right now. There's still something for me in here. Fuddies, fuddies. We Umbrella? No? Don't we umbrella? Alright then. Oh. She made this with her own hands. She was really good. I've seen this, I've seen this. Okay, ooh. Is that a... Can we open you? Something draws me to this trunk. Is it the memories locked within? Is that locked? Do we need we a key to get in there? We use this trunk to store trinkets and papers, but... I can't help think... It's too painful. I want to, but... Okay. Not yet. Not now then. Fine. Oh, what's this? Come, love, with peace in your heart, said Niav of the Ice Blue Eyes. Hmm. Blue eyes. I've got to love the blue eyes. Okay. Anything else we can do over this side? The table is worn but sturdy. <laughs> just like our relationship was. Or Wait, is. was? I just don't know anymore. Was as in... Oh, but... Look okay. what I made, hun. In case we ever need to sweep something under the carpet. <laughs> Lol. See the pattern of yellow squares? It's from this rug I remembered from my nursery. I must have been like three or four, but it always stuck with me. Fair enough, fair enough. Okay. Ooh, what can we do over here? Ooh, beam. That, that does not look particularly waterproof. I hope it doesn't rain. Bad. Our refuge from the world. A place of warmth and passion. Hmm, okay. Let's have a look at the other window. Not that we can see it's it out there either. It's a beautiful day, though there's an unnatural calm surrounding it. Can you see a thing? I've always loved the hazy afternoon shades of this place. Ooh, the clock. clock is a trophy from our flea market adventures. Chalk this particular purchase up to every cabin needs one. A really annoying ticky clock. The ticking begins to feel homey after a while. No. The first night was a nightmare. <laughs> no, it doesn't. No. Time never mattered much to us while we were hiding no, from the, rest of the world. No, that's not We used nice. to keep a pitcher of water and a glass on this nightstand. But they're not here now. Okay. And like its sibling, this lamp would last for months. That is, that is. What have we got in here? Books. Oh, what's that? She was special. Contradictory. She didn't mind these, actually. I think she was into them too. Fair enough. That looks interesting. We can always try it. Fair enough, fair enough. Do I take fancy? Sometimes we joked we needed to be so far out in the woods <laughs> because that's how our sex life was. Oh dear. Far out. Well, what have we got in here then? Anything in here? No? Queens. Oh, no, okay. Um. Oh, that's fun. So we've got a letter. Dearest, how do I say any of this? I like your way with words, but if I don't write this, I don't know what I'll do. My life feels so unreal now, dreamlike, but wonderfully so. Let me try, even if clumsily. The hours I spent with you when we last met are precious to me. I was so lost such a short time ago. Everything seemed drained of color and feeling. I think we were meant to find each other, to bring meaning to our lives again, make sense of the confusion shrouding both of us. When we stepped into the crystal silence of the snowy woods, away from the chatter of the guests, all nature seemed expectant, 
as if holding its breath, witnessing a rare moment of something infinitely better than what life in the ordinary run of things has to offer. Do you remember how the light crust of the snow glittered in the reflected light of the country this is house? very poetic. How the copse of trees in which we walked was haloed with a magical aura? I felt the chill of the night air, and you opened your coat and enfolded me in your arms, and we hugged tight, sharing the warmth, sharing the only thing any of us have to share on this earth when you think about it. And then you toppled us on the snow, you devil. <laughs> we laughed and rolled around, my head already spinning from the wine and crisp pure night air and the stillness all around. We lay back and I guess when I realized what I was seeing. A uh -huh. luminous starscape, like a vast velvet cloth sprinkled with powdered sugar, like it can only be seen in the countryside. I had tears in my eyes when I turned to you and we kissed, and it felt like the only moment in all of time, or outside time, and ours was the only spark that could ignite the universe. You gave me these moments. You complete me in ways I never knew to dream of. Let me be the one who makes sense of the confusion whenever you feel lost again. We can make our own world against the rest of the world if need be. Together we can silence all the demons, heal all the wounds. I love you. That's very Thanks. sweet. Okay, what I else do you have? So much. How is it possible that I can't remember her face? I honestly don't know, dude. Seriously. There's a strand of blonde hair in the comb. There is indeed. Clever boy. Hers. I used it too, when shaving. There's only an outhouse, and for some reason, whoever erected the rickety thing didn't think to include wall-to-wall -wall mirrors. So, <laughs> this came in handy. That would come in handy. Pretty shambolic, isn't it? The organization of its contents isn't much better. <laughs> It'd be a shame to say we're fashionistas. Fair enough, we're never that big on appearance. Serena has this oh, mystical aura about her. Even when she's wearing oh. one of my mom's charming knitted <laughs> sweaters from your mother. These keys are for the cabin and the car. Okay, fair enough. If the keys are here, does she have her spare? I would assume so. Anything in here? What's that? They prevent my blood pressure from skyrocketing. Doctor's orders. And Serena's. You do what you told. <laughs> I'm generally not fond of taking medication. I find it hard to believe ingesting a few chemicals will do me much good in the long run. Okay, if you say so. What else do we have? Some Commune Evidence. Serena's favorite perfume. Hmm. I've always told Serena that she doesn't need to wear perfume. Her presence is magical enough Aww. already. Okay, what else have we got? It's only over there we have a look, doesn't it? The furniture came with the cabin, but the bed clothes we brought with us. Okay. A okay. place like this needs some luxury. Let's... But without her. Oh, oh. No, it's okay. It's not frozen. For some reason, light bulbs wouldn't last long in this lamp. Poltergeist. I never looked into it. Calling it now. Let's go. Okay. She adored all flowers. things of nature. Pretty purple I remember flowers. her long walks out in the woods. Hmm. She is fairly religious. Not me. I'm the cold and cynical bastard. Oh dear. But I don't remember that <laughs> ever being an issue between us. She always thought our relationship was a blessing. God, how I miss her. <laughs> no longer the cynical asshole, I guess. <laughs> It's freezing on me, it's very annoying. So we oh more Quite a large armoire for our admittedly Spartan needs. She uses most of it. And we all have our skeletons in the closet, but hmm. not Serena. That is perfect. That is. Anything in the drawers? Nope. Nope. Next drawer. Nope. Nothing in there. Just some clothes. Okay, so. Is that everything? I think that's. 
God, that was creepy. That sounded like there was someone else in the house. <gasps> oh, that's weird. Okay, Laura said this was kind of scary. Now I'm freaked out. Oop. Oh, okay, that's a chair. That's where I was before, obviously. What's that? Ah, face. This was taken on that crisp winter night at our mutual friend's hunting lodge. We came back indoors laughing, giddy as teenagers. <laughs> it was truly like an enchanted time, like we were in a magic circle where no sorrow or pain could touch us. That sounds nice. The fuck? Hello, clock. Do I go say hi to the All clock? All those moments we sat at this table, laughing, smiling, and simply looking in each other's eyes. Will we have them again someday? I'm sure you will. She'll come back. Hearts, club, band. <laughs> Why are you singing? I clicked on the pepper. Pig and pepper. Alice in Wonderland. With all these associations, links, plays on words. My head is full of them and, and it never stops. Oh dear. Yes, I could sure use some pepper today. God, I'm so bored. No Just a pepper shaker, really. We got this set from that clearance sale, however long ago that was. Yet we never needed to refill it. Huh. Is it my imagination, or are you using even more these days? More salt. Point. I am on medication for blood pressure you after all. probably should watch the salt. I'm determined to make a change when she comes back. Yes. No more indulgences. I'm do things right. Good, good on you. Not the healthier type, just regular table salt. This table has seen many happy times. The meals we shared, or when we just used to stay up late with a bottle of wine and talk. Oh, how we talked. Talking is always good. Oh, oh, stand up again, of course. <laughs> Confuse me for a minute. Then. Without any activity, the corner feels cold and lifeless. To be fair, it is. So it's not that surprising. I didn't cook much for her. Always so worried about my stuff. Well, that's silly. Damn. I can't even remember what her favorite meal was. So you couldn't remember her face? Now you can't remember her favorite meal? I'd give anything to see her standing here again, making coffee. Ooh, or coffee. Sandwich. When she was happy, Ooh. she'd hum her favorite songs as she covered Click her waxed. <laughs> I can't remember. Feeling peckish, dear? <gasps> oh, dear. The stove looks like something from World War One. Yeah, it does. Where are these? Oh, I looked at all these books, didn't I? Purple. Someone said, work and love are the only things that ever really happened to us. Was it Freud or Marilyn Monroe? Similar. Come sit with me. I want to talk. There's something I have to tell you. No cuddles this time? I have been trying, and believe me, I've been trying so hard. I almost have it. What was she trying to tell me? The most comfortable spot mm -hmm. in the cabin. Well, there's nothing going the on with that picture, course. was there? Chair. I kept saying I'd paint these chairs, add some color to this place. One more thing I never got around to. What color? I sure hope she comes back soon. We can sit down and discuss hmm. our problems, uh, like we always did. We could always work things out. When did you let so. this window get so gunked up? Um, time. <laughs> there didn't seem to be much reason to keep it clean. Just overgrown bushes outside, brambles, and hey, thistles. They can be pretty too. Go outside yet? Why? We might just as well <laughs> stay here. Dude, you just replied to me. That was creepy. I should really stay. I'm so tired anyway. Okay, do you want to go to bed? As always, I automatically went to the window side and she took the one by the armoire. Some of her scent still lingers. So is that a no? What's the matter with me? I can't seem to remember even ordinary things. When was the last time? That clock keeps... Dong donging? That's not even the right word. How long has it been, I wonder? I can't tell. How can you not tell? I miss her so much. That ticking. It never stops. You just noticed. 
I've wasted so much time in my life. What the hell? Did, ever Did you just go darker? To show her how much I truly cared? Sunlight. Birdsong. Nothing feels worse when there's no hope. No hope? No chance of anything. I'm a little bit confused as to what's just happened. All the real color faded from it long ago. Okay. The stains on this bed Ooh. suddenly make me mad. Angry. Why are you angry? Dude. Let's just take a chill pill. How could I have been so blind? Her vanity. Always fixing her hair. Dude. Her bed. Gotta fix your hair before bed. I can't even bear to He's look at nice. my face. She's Done a number on me. I don't think it's her. She once told me how I supposedly used words to fool her somehow, but what did she think this stuff was? Natural? Okay. Um. Keys. Where are you going? Oh, that's rich. Just run away. Run away. Don't run away. No, no, no. No. I don't think there was much in them, was there? Letter. Ooh, pardon me. Um. Pills. I tried to flush these a long time ago, but someone noticed. Oh dear. I cared about my impotent life. She never descended to criticizing my looks, though. Even when we fought, even when my hairline started going, it was a sore point for me. Hmm. Thoughts are all over the place. Together. Yes, get it together. Guess I could have thanked that heartless. Whoa. At least once well, that too could turn quickly. Up her body. Since when did she become a slut? This isn't like me. I must calm. Down. Yes, calm. If anyone is to be blamed. That's me. Be calm, Mister Person. Um. How about this trunk? Wouldn't let us in here before. Oh, yeah. I sit here on the train, Ooh, taking letter. me to my final farewell to the ones who brought me to this world. I see the smiling couples on their way to new adventures and think, it used to be us. We had joy and laughter and friends once, but a memory is not the thing itself. You're very good at letting things you don't want to face slip off you. You continue as if nothing has changed, lost in your own lifeless world. Words and dreams may be enough for you. You know what? You'll get a chance to test that soon. I question how I once saw things. How much of what I thought we had were my own feelings, and how much of your manipulation? Because you are so very good with words, aren't you? You knew how to okay. use them when we met, and for the longest time, I went along with the romantic whirl you conjured up around our shabby, isolated existence. Oh, it took me long enough to see it for what it was. And there were these moments that you swept me off on foolish flights of fancy, when I threw myself into your fantasies. You wove your spell, plying me with your magic and with wine and I'm really measure, confused. And I was taken in like the lost little girl I was. It was all. Do you oh, realize you. all the pain it was you all caused amazing me? Amazing and they say magical. They and whether someone loves you, now she's a slut. The and they're the fighting. No more convince well, me anymore sort of. than I can make my own mother or father draw breath again. Your aloofness tells a different story. Okay. I no longer know what you're thinking. With my parents gone and with your refusal to even accompany me in my time of need, something Wow. Good. Or maybe it happened long ago, but I never saw it. You so didn't go before, with her? After everything. I don't make you feel comfortable? Really? That's Dude. all you have to say? I won't waste any more life waiting for things that'll never come. Of course, that that's what harsh. you expect me to do. Play the good wife so no one will laugh at you for being the failure you are to shield you from the truth of your existence. Lost in your books and vapid verse, blithely drifting into the mists of time, as if not even a footnote, when you could be raking at it if you'd only used your words for anything other than personal indulgence. You talked and talked about your path, the winter blueness of my eyes, all that nonsense, and the years rolled by, the seasons came and went, on and on, you pursuing your dreams that will never be, lost in your damned words, looking for clues you'll never hmm. find. I'm sure you're doing it even now with your rotting books. You took the best years of my life. And gave only empty words in return. We've gone as far as we can, and something's got to give. Maybe it did. Now I remember. It was me all the time. I lost her, Ooh. and it's all my fault. Her jewelry box. Jewelry box. What is it doing here? It's just a bunch of schmaltzy junk. A shrine to naivety. 
I should just destroy this useless junk. Fair enough. Not even the venom inside me gives me strength. Yeah, don't go destroying stuff. Um, Changeable man. It's not changed. Insolent wretch. Or am I going insane? <laughs> Sounds like Serena, all right. That's her father's realm. She was a daughter of the Celtic sea god Mananan. Mananan. <laughs> what was it? Mukler. <laughs> I found that way too amusing. Okay. Um What do we do with this jewelry? Sit down. Oh. We need to talk. Is that me sit down? Oh. She's angry now. Part of me realizes I should be more shocked by this, but for some reason I just feel numb. What is with your Beyond face? It. Look, he's smiling. He's smiling. He was lying to me and manipulating me all the time. You were just saying it was your fault, dude. Why did I let her do that? I'm the one who should have been scowling. Dude. She played me like a harp and made me look like a complete idiot. Truth is, I could have used this spice oh to get some God. of her abominations okay. down my throat. She never had any sense for balancing a meal. It was either spicy hot or cringeworthy bland. Hey, you said you liked it, blonde it dude. Much better fare before my family fell on hard times. Huh. Yes, go ahead and empty the whole salt shaker on your meal. I hope you choke. <laughs> she was always yammering about the salt, feigning concern about my blood pressure. Should have emptied this into her lying throat till she vomited. Wow. Jewelry box? Why, why did, oh, it did work. Oh. <gasps> Ooh. Ring or mine. It's it, gonna be hers, dude. Look at your what finger. What are you doing here? Oh, please, no. It's hers. Are you, I can't yours would be on your finger. Here. Where the hell is Unless she? she took yours off. No. It can't be true. No. No, I didn't do it. I need to wake up from this nightmare. All of this... These... I remember how happy these made her. She you sound smiled, sad about that. That wonderful smile. I must have gifted these to make amends or something. Or did I? Did I ever gift her anything? She loved her trinkets more than she loved me. Dude! I couldn't care yourself. less about this damn thing. Okay, right. Um... Why torture myself? I'm too upset oh, to oh. even think straight. Okay, sorry, sorry. Going. Uh, where haven't we looked? It must be full of dust mites. I should burn no, it. No, you don't want to burn it. Ooh. Why must life always end up so sordid and hateful? I don't know, dude. I don't know. Oh, don't freeze up on me. What was in here again? It's. Just a book. Oh, the Bible. What good will reading a fairy tale <laughs> do me? Oh, dear. God has never been there for me when I needed comfort. Why would he want to go out of his mysterious ways to help me now? That is, that is. Stupid, feeble-minded woman with her stern, wow. menial things. A little bit harsh. It was she who didn't deserve me. Really? I wouldn't waste my intellect on this. You are this being sublunary a bit harsh, dude. No, no. No. I'm not crawling in there. I'm too riled up for that, and it's it's just not dark enough anyway. Close curtains? Ooh, what, how do I get out of here? Oh, there we go. Can we go outside yet? A part of me still thinks you'll forgive me and come back. But I've lost all hope now. Aww. Do I deserve to be forgiven? What about all the things she did, and all the things she said? I'm sure you've done equal things, dude. The light is so dim here. Makes me want to chop down every tree outside. Go on There's then. only a limited window of opportunity for everything. Hmm. And I wasted it. It was just that in here, wasn't it? I couldn't care less about the damn thing now. That is, that is. Oh, lost control of my mouse. That incessant noise. I should smash this useless antique to pieces oh, you really right should. now. You should. Go it on. can't keep the time for five minutes straight. <laughs> Chimes completely at random and never stops making that infernal noise. What? But hey, guess who thought it was so cute? Uh, uh, 
Dude. Voice mimicking. Not, not, not good. Have we been in here yet? Ah, wardrobe. That hasn't happened before. So, what have we got? Coat. Jumpery thingy. It's not just clicking on the entire wardrobe. It's not clicking on it. Just... Oh, dear. Oh, wow. Okay. Um... It's a dead person, dude. Oh it my isn't. god. Is that her? She's a bit grey. How did it happen? I can't remember. Dude. Did you kill her? It's already rotten beyond recognition. Don't call it an it. This is a what well. Time no. has passed. Maybe you should call it an it. It's dry and withered. A body takes at least weeks to okay how... I can't even remember how I did it maybe I didn't do I have brain damage distinct possibility honestly I wouldn't be surprised okay time time to leave now I don't really want to look at that anymore <laughs> oh my god okay um gonna say that can anybody else hear that It's like talking in the distance and it's creeping me out. I think it's time to leave. You've got to leave now, dude. Those noises sound like more than one person. Who can it be? The police? Oh god. Are Coming they coming for, you, for me? Oh, haha, <laughs> they are. I deserve it, but I want to see who it is first. You can't see out the windows. Something about those voices. I must know. Which, which the window? window? That one? Ooh. Oh my god. I am so creeped out right now. Do you realize how stupid this was? We had a plan. I took measures to ensure nothing like this would happen. But no, it couldn't help your damn self. Okay. We can't risk moving it now. The bulldozers are coming any minute. Bulldozers? Fire will do it. Who? Wait. You think they will buy it after all this time? It's been months since you. Don't worry. It's all covered. You spent much time here. Um. Well, wait. What? The kerosene. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Okay. Um. Can I leave? Oh shit! You forgot your. Fuck. Um, so I can hear fiery things. Why did you do that? Can you calm down? I couldn't bear to wear it any longer. It's in a safe place. I need to we'll pick get out. No, 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 no. No. Not like this. No, 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 no. No. Um. Oh. Um. <laughs> how do I not die here? Um. Okay. I guess that's the end. <laughs> Pretty sure I just burnt to death. Um, so yeah, that happened. Um, yeah. Okay. So, I guess I will leave it there. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe and such. And yeah, take care. Bye.